Meanwhile, the fighting continued overnight in the Middle East as Israeli ground forces pushing further into Gaza now. Israeli military says it has rescued an Israeli soldier taken hostage by Hamas two weeks ago. It's believed that there are still more than 200 hostages remaining in Gaza, including a number of Americans. Hamas has released four so far. It says it would let more go in return for thousands of Palestinian prisoners held by Israel. Israeli's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu once again says even the idea of a ceasefire is off the table. Just as the United States would not agree to a ceasefire after the bombing of Pearl Harbor or after the terrorist attack of 9-11, Israel will not agree to a cessation of hostilities with Hamas after the horrific attacks of October 7th. In Gaza, aid workers say the humanitarian crisis continues to grow worse by the hour, despite truckloads of supplies coming in starting last week. U.S. State Department, however, says it's making, quote, significant progress in getting aid in to the Gaza Strip.